You call me a god. You call me a god. You call me a god. Well, that's good. It's really good. Oh, there's one. She produced it, didn't I? Oh, that's Carol. Oh, there's one in the middle of the floor. They're dancing. They're driving. They're riding. They're hovering. I don't know what they're doing. Hovering. In space suits. Looks like looks like crash does dummy they're driving. That's what they look like. That's what the camera makes them look like. Mm. Mm. Huh. So let's see the hard find pictures or the good pictures or whatever pictures I'm gonna get today. I understood the one I got with the horn busted off last night. Understood. Thank you. There you go. It looks like a penguin doing penance. I guess that's me and that's a tear. And I guess you're mocking me for still believing, but that's okay. Because first of all, <laughs> not Catholic. I was a child and figured that one out. When I was going to the Catholic Church, I did go to the Catholic Church for years, but I'm not Catholic. But I understand the symbolism of the black and white. And you know, I've always said that I'm just black and white paint on a paper plate, and sometimes I'll touch and turn gray. I do have a big gray zone. That is probably going to get me spit out. But I'd rather have a gray zone and get spit out than to be black. Totally black. And I'm not talking about race. Than to be cold and non-compassionate. Because I have to remind myself daily that y'all are not human. And some of you are. I mean, you know, some of you are hybrids. But you are not wired the way I am. You do not feel the emotions that I feel, and I'm an intuitive empath. So whatever emotions I do feel, I feel ten times stronger than your average person. So yeah, I cry a lot. But that's okay, because I feel great after I cry. I feel better. It releases a lot of stress. It actually is better for me than releasing it on somebody and hurting somebody. Because I have no desire to do that. So if my sin puts me in hell, or my drug doing, or my uh, imaginary cheating, or whatever it is that puts me in hell, it will not be because I was gray. <laughs> I mean, being gray might be what gets me there because that's where the you know some sin comes in because I I. I do sin, um, and I'll never be holy, probably. I, I really don't know how to be, and, and I'm going to try to learn, but I, I, I'm not striving for holy. I'm just striving for better than I was yesterday and better tomorrow than I am today. That's my goal.
Young boys are my family. But sometimes you just can't hang out with your family, you know? It doesn't mean I don't love you. doesn't mean I won't pray for you. doesn't mean I won't bless you. And I'll be there if you really need me, as long as it doesn't compromise my soul. But as far as being your whipping girl and your fun dummy, that's over. That's over. No matter what I got to do to make it stop. Even if it means dying. I'm willing to die. Before I go through it again. Before I just continue to let myself be walked on. And y'all wipe your boots off. The mud off your boots onto my face every day. It's not going to happen anymore. So Richard, I'm asking you to stand with me. I'm asking you to forgive me and stand with me. And if you don't, just let me know it. And, and you know, we'll, we'll amicably, calmly, you know, walk on. Walk on. And uh, everybody leaves holding their head up. I think it's a great solution, but of course nobody will think that because.